Woodbury County supervisors are facing a big decision tonight. Tear down or replace or repair to outdated overpasses on I-29. The bridges are in need of renovations, which means Woodbury County has to make a decision about what's next for them. KCA Unite's Jacob Russo tells us what the options are in our top story. The 290th Street overpass near Salix and the 310th Street overpass near Sloan are both about 14 feet above I-29. But federal regulations require bridges to be 17 feet above an interstate. The Iowa DOT is looking to spend $1.5 million to raise each bridge to the federal minimum or to pay the county, led by engineer Mark Nara, to destroy them. The DOT district engineer contacted my office and made us the offer to pay the county $1.5 million per structure if we agreed to have them eliminated. Raising the bridges would take three to four months, but getting rid of the bridges would be quicker. Either way, something has to be done. You can either meet federal highway regulations by either raising the bridges or taking them out altogether and eliminating the overhead hazard on the interstate. That decision is something Nara doesn't want to make on his own. Getting rid of the bridges could hurt the local residents, so he and the Woodbury County supervisors want their input. They have scheduled a public meeting where residents in the area can come and express their interest in the in these projects. That meeting takes place on September 18th and soon after the county will make its decision. In Woodbury County, Jacob Russo, KCAU 9 News.